All right, so I made a function that basically gets the image ID of a decal using the asset ID of the decal. Um, uh, big thanks to the these two dev form posts because um, that was how I figured out how to do this. But basically, if you were to take uh, an image, uh, well, yeah, let's say you were to take a, a, the asset ID of an image or a decal, right, and you wanted to use it for this thing, right? Um, you can see here that the actual ID ends in 535, but when I paste it inside of the decal, right, it changes the texture ID to you see 526. So let's say you want to do this via script, you want to be able to like do it right by just putting in the raw asset ID. So to do that, I made a function which basically uses the content. Uh, it was a thumbnail content method. I forgot what it was called exactly, but yeah, I'm gonna leave the dev form links down below for you guys to look more into that. You can use it for a, for things like uh, decals, uh, faces, uh, like avatar, like the headshot of the character or like the full character, etc. So yeah, go down below in the description if you want more information on that. But all you do is that once you have this uh, function right here, you can pass in the asset ID of the decal and it's going to return the string for you to use as the image ID. Um, it also has a resize parameter. If you give, uh, if you give it a resize parameter of either 150 uh, or 420, it's going to change the resolution for you. If you don't pass in a uh, resize parameter is going to default to 420. Um, but yeah, so uh, I have this implemented into a a GUI so I can show you guys. Uh, if you paste in the ID here, you see it's going to show you the 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 image, and then the image that it uses, the actual ID that it uses, is the thumbnail thing. See see right here it's it's uh, this so the function itself should be in the paste bin link in the description and if you want to use this if you want to see this module this model for yourself that will also be down below in the description but again um, you could also look in the description for the dev form post about this uh, method of doing it but yeah, I hope this helped you. If this helped you, uh, really, I, I prefer you go down below in the dev form post and leave a like on those, uh, on those posts. But of course, a like on this video will help uh, share it as well. So, um, yeah, take it easy.